Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So I hope you're all doing well. Today is going to be another fun packed video. So I'm going to train today with Courtney. You probably know who she is. She's another honour girly. So rude, honestly. I cannot wait till this is over. In about a month all gone we are going to dedicate a super gym in liverpool today i've already been so is courtney but we've both only been to the one in the city so we're actually going to go to the one in the wirral today which is fun because it's meant to be like double the size of the one in the city which you'd think it'd be the other way around but anyway i'm gonna go meet her and i think we're gonna do like a little drive with me sort of thing as well which is fun and then i think we'll also we'll probably end up getting like some food after or something um but yeah i'm gonna take you along on the day okay i just want to show you my fit first because she is good so this is the new honor active club hoodie launched in the birthday collection and then this is oh this is a club tee also launched in the birthday collection. I can't really show you properly. And then these also launched in the birthday collection. <laughs> these shorts. I love these shorts. This is my favourite colour to drop, I think. Out of all the colours that Honor has. Um, just perfect neutral colours. They just go with absolutely everything. But as you can probably tell by the kind of fit, we are training legs. We're training quads today. The big boys. Look at them. Um, and I just feel like shorts and a t-shirt is the perfect quad day fit. But yeah, let's go. Hey okay, guys. Hey guys. Hey Courtney's vlog. So, we're in the car. It's how long is it away? About 55 minutes. Don't. I'm sure. No it is. Did you not know I thought it was well close. Wait, You're wait, joking. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait, I need to get the right address though because there's two. Yeah, put so the word on, on in. Instagram. No, it's well far. I told you. An hour and a quarter. Oh, Fuck I off. I it was that. Why is it that? What? I thought it was like 50 I minutes. I thought you were well close. To Liverpool. <laughs> we're not even near, we're like 30 minutes away from Ma well we're about 20 minutes away from Manchester. Yeah to be fair it only took me 40 minutes to get here. Oh fucking cow. So <laughs> we've got a road trip going road down. Trip. This is why I said oh I'll bring my camera. Yeah. Because we're gonna have to I don't do know I'm gonna put mine. Do you know what? I usually put mine here but it usually slips around. You could put some underneath it. Like the straw. Let's, let's try it. <laughs> Yeah. So it's an hour and fifteen minutes away, so it's a, a pretty long road trip. We're We've both been to one of them, there, haven't we? Yeah, I've been to the smaller one. This is the and largest it's still huge. Gym. Yeah, it's, it's massive. I don't know how big this one's gonna be. This is the largest gym of the UK. Have you not seen the TikToks? Yeah. yeah. That's what made me want to come. I think my engine's off. Yeah. Let's well, I'll vlog when we get there so you can see everything. I think there's just multiple machines. Yeah, I've vlogged of here twice. everything. <laughs> Have you? Yeah. Oh Everyone's gonna be scared. fucking sick of seeing this chick. Really? Sorry, it's this fine. way. This yeah, way. I'm gonna turn around. Oh, okay. You can go out there. Can you? Yeah, okay. Um. So yeah, I'll check back in when we get there. <laughs> when we get there. <laughs> um. And keep you updated. I'll speak to you guys yeah. later. Alright guys, we have just arrived to the gym. That was a very flustering drive. I need to just take a chill pill after that drive. Um, we went under a tunnel and we were like descending. Like my ears were popping. <laughs> Me and Connor were like, what is going on? Anyway, we've got here in one piece. That's all that matters. But like it took ages. It's, this is actually so far from Courtney's. I thought it was closer. Anyway, it's over now. We're here. But we're just going to have some pre, have a little pre-workout dancey dance in the car. Um, we were deciding whether to have oxy shred or pre and we're going to go for the hardcore sesh and have pre. Um, because go big or go home, right? That's my motto. But I'm going to have two scoops of this and we are going to smash this sesh. Smash quad workout. I'm, I'm really ready for it. I'm ready, I'm ready to go. I'm I didn't um, bring my tomorrow. shaker, so I've just got a bottle of water from in there. Yeah, but it's perfect. It's apple flavour. So. It's apple and blackcurrant it was flavoured water. I don't know where I'm looking. There's four cameras here, guys. There's four, four cameras in front of me. <laughs> How am I going to be able to pour that in there? These scoops are massive. Fuck! <laughs> this might be a problem. Wait, let me just put mine in. <laughs> okay. Let me do another. You're gonna do two scoops? Yeah. Oh my Jesus. Go big or go home. Oh, I don't do um, pre-workout. You gotta go big or go home. <laughs> I don't do pre-workout. I'm changing her. I just do oxy shred because oxy shred has 150 milligrams of caffeine. Wait, how much does this have? Let me have a look. 
I'm going to do, do to half, half scoop first because this is going to be quite difficult. <laughs> Put that underneath. That's a good idea. <laughs> I did not think this through. We need the Oxy Shred scoop. Oh, yeah, oh, why didn't we do that? I don't know. <laughs> Let's use the oxygen too. Okay, right. For fuck's sake. Look at that. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that'd be effective. Why don't we try it? <laughs> Look how orange this mango <laughs> one is. What? Oh, orange is. Oh my god. It's gone proper solid. Right, okay. Where is it gone? Is that... How much do you want? Is that Should enough? Should I do a full scoop? Yeah. Go for it. I'm changing you. Right. I'll be literally off my tits in there. <laughs> Watch. Oh, that's much better. Why do they have to make the scoop so big? My car's fucked. <laughs> my, my car is well and truly fucked, right? This is actually nice, you know. I nice. think it'll be pain with that drink. I'm kind of jealous that you've got. Mmm, delicious. Is it nice? Try it. You try mine. <laughs> that's really good with that drink. <laughs> Mm. I'm just gonna neck it. <laughs> You're gonna down it all. Should we do it? Okay. That was fun. I felt like I'm at the club. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna probably throw up. No. <sighs> Don't say that. No, come on, Connie. You're alright. <laughs> You're okay. Come on, you can push through it. Guys, look at this bathroom. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, this is way bigger than the other one. No, Courtney, these are like widening mirrors. My legs look bigger. <laughs> I wish this was real. <laughs> oh my god. You see them quads, guys? <laughs> it's all a lie. My quads don't look like that. Wow. Oh I feel like I'm in a fancy hotel. What? Courtney, we're not even in the fucking gym yet. <laughs> Guys, we're in Dreamland. I can't even count how many squat racks there are. But this one is so much bigger um, than the one in the city. So if you want to come to one, come to this one. It's way better. Like, it's dead. I think there's about five people in here. So, highly recommend. So we're going to be starting off with a warm-up as always, starting off with a dynamic warm-up. You want to be doing dynamic warm-ups before you work out and then you want to be doing static stretches afterwards. So as you can see here, it's mainly just like leg swings and stuff like that, just to basically limber up and get as mobile as possible. But we really both were not feeling squats today. So we started with a pendulum squat instead because I don't know about you, but barbell squats sometimes can be very intimidating and I feel like you have to be in the right mood to do barbell squats like I was talking about this on my stories the other day I just think if you're not in the right mindset to do squats it is just never ever gonna end well and it literally seems like the worst thing in the world when you don't want to do them so we decided to do pendulum squats instead which were actually really fun because we don't have machines like this at our gyms so we were just having a little bit of a play around obviously new gym biggest gym in the UK wanted to try out some kind of different equipment but it was really good got some good quad engagement um but we were doing about four sets of 10 reps um obviously i would normally do regular barbell squats instead of this if you want to copy this workout and you don't have this machine um so don't worry about that just do barbell squats instead or you can do goblet squats with a dumbbell it doesn't really matter any type of squat um can be just as effective but i always find a barbell squat the most effective um but in this case i could not be bothered <laughs>
Next up, we moved on to some Bulgarians, the deathly dreaded exercise, however, a very effective exercise. Um, so I like doing these both on my quad days and on my glutes and hamstrings days. Obviously, you can adapt these to target the, both the different muscles. Um, to target my quads more in this movement, I keep more of a close stance and I don't lean my body forward as much as I would if I was trying to hit the glutes. If I was trying to hit the glutes, I would have my front supporting foot that's on the floor a little bit further outwards and I would have my body a little bit further towards the ground. Um, but obviously I was tagging the quads, so the close the stance was a little bit closer. But we both completed three sets of around 10 to 12 reps with this. And um, was going for a little bit more of a volume focused session with more reps and a lighter weight. And then gonna slide right into the leg press here. And I did three to four sets, I think. I can't remember if we did three or four sets um, of 10 to 12 reps. Again, as I said, a little bit more volume in the higher rep range. Um, but obviously, as you can see, I was keeping it more quad focused by having a closer stance and having my feet a little bit further down on the panels, um, as you can see. But I actually found this really good. I got a really good connection in the quads here. Come on, let's go. Nice. Come on, let's go. Keep going, keep going. Come on. Come on, you got more. Go, 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 go. Come on, two more. Come on, come on, one more. Nice, nice, nice. Alrighty then, swiftly moving on to the leg extensions. For the last exercise, this is my favourite quad isolation exercise. It's just different gravy, honestly. I walk, well, I barely walk out of the gym after these. I hobble out of the gym. Me and Courtney could barely even walk and I had to drive a long way to get back. It was not fun. Um, but yeah, we did a drop set on the leg extension, which is also like my favourite thing to do. I feel like isolation exercises like these, as well as like the hamstring curl and stuff, I really like to do drop sets on them. It's just finishes off that session and just literally adds the cherry on top of the cake honestly and um, but we did eight reps into 10 into 10 reps into 12 reps and we repeated that for three sets and um, when you go from each like rep range you want to have no rest in between you literally want to go straight into the next and then the next so i would not recommend going heavy for any of these rep ranges at all really i was on like a mid weight for the eight reps and then a lighter weight for the 10 and then a really light weight for the 12 reps but as you can see, when, once Courtney finishes, um, we could literally barely walk. My quads were numb, which is the best feeling in my opinion. Um, but that's it for this workout. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Guys, I'm sorry about that leg extension drop set. That's not even funny. 
that's just pure torture. Um, okay. Hey guys, you gonna what? Hey guys, we finished the workout. Um, my legs are currently numb. I'm dying. Um, we're just looking for a place to go to eat because I feel weak as fuck. Um, and I'm really thirsty and I'm tired. It's not a good combination. We're both dying over here. Um, I'm just posting on Instagram. I don't know what I don't know what's on to you. I'm not okay. No. What? To clean your legs. I know. It's bad, isn't it? Look how dirty it is. You're crazy, girl. All right, guys. I'm having to film on my phone. I left my camera in the car. But we're at Nando's. We were on the motorway. I didn't think I could carry on any longer. So we had to stop halfway, we halfway. and the traffic was like so bad. So we're going to continue on that journey once we're finished. But for now, don't judge me, I get peri -tamer. I don't like the spice. <laughs> Banging. Just look at that shot. She's juicy. And I also got halloumi. Okay guys, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing me and Courtney in action on a little leg day. We're definitely going to train together again soon. Um, so if you want like to see that content again, if you want me to film it again for my YouTube, then please let me know. Um, but yeah, had such a fun day. If you are thinking of going to that gym, you definitely should. It's such a like good day out. It's a good trip with your bestie or your boyfriend or whatever. I'm definitely taking my boyfriend to that one because I took him to the other one last time and it's much smaller. So I need to take him to this one so they can see both the gyms. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!